Well, it looks a little different there today than it has the past few days. Sure does, Liz. Let's take a look at the display board. Most Southwest flights are taking off on time, but there are still a few issues. Some flights have been grounded today, and of course, for those travelers, the headaches continue. After days of chaos, Southwest Airlines promising to be back on schedule tomorrow, providing relief to frustrated customers. The solution to Southwest's problem is so simple, but you saw this coming. And until they regionalize their staffs, they're going to continue to have problems. The airline making the holiday season a nightmare for travelers. Over the last week, the airline canceling more than 15,000 flights after the massive storm, stranding people at airports across the country and forcing others to cancel their holiday plans. Clearly, we need to double down on our already existing plans to upgrade systems for these extreme circumstances so that we never again face what's happening uh, right now. Mayor Lightfoot releasing a statement today saying in part, Southwest remains a key partner at Chicago's airports and a key employer in our region. I made it abundantly clear to Southwest there is still a tremendous amount of work they must undertake to do right by travelers and take ownership of this issue. Frequent Southwest passengers are demanding long-term action to prevent this system-wide failure from happening again. They didn't give us our luggage, so these clothes have been on us for four <laughs> days. You see the Southwest check-in counter behind me. Not many people in line. It is looking a lot better today than previous days, much more relaxed. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.